So, as it stands right now, uh, the, the APC is saying, look, this nation was brought, almost brought to its knees. And based on what they have seen in the past, at least in the fi last five years, according to the vice president, this nation's economy was uh, looted uh, 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 to super. I mean, those are some of the words that was looted. And the issue will be, should we look forward or we should sometimes look backward and look forward? My dear, you are still simply this question looted, looted. What I am saying is, let them go to action and let them, those who have followed the corrupt people follow action. Show results. When Obama came in, you, you all knew what the previous government did. He never referred to it. He just went into action. What's your assessment of the anti-corruption war? Uh, not encouraging. Really? Not, not as much as the blood or the emphasis put on it. Considering the Consider state of the judiciary in Nigeria. And there, these are all excuses. For instance, I don't support the question of doing anti-corruption against the rule of law. Anything that does not... Is that in any case of that? Of course. Why, the way they, they evaded the, 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 the judges, the way they disobey court orders, the way they did everything just because they want to do, they want to wipe off corruption. The moment that begins, you and I are not safe. They just do anything and say corruption, put him there. Why? Why? No, 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 it's corrupt. The, then we are not obeying, the, we are not under a democratic system. You see, in an attempt to do the, something good, we should not go back to the ages. If you were the head of state or the president of the Federal Republic, and you came in as a president and you discover the state at which corruption has dealt with this nation, what would you rather do? Well, I will do exactly what he's doing, put the FCC in charge and carry on my own program. Right. Sorry, I would like to... And show, I show, the, I show results. Sorry, I'd like to post it because uh, Larry Suraj has rejoined us on telephone. Quickly, before we get disappointed again by the network. Uh, so, what do you make of what we've seen as a back and forth between the, the past government, the, uh, the uh, former uh, party in government, and the ruling APC? Hello, Shim. Go ahead, please. A pleasure having you, Mr. Suraj. Yes, my pleasure too here. How are you? Yeah, so the back and forth. Give us names, and now the APC government has given names. What do you make of the back and forth? Yeah, I, I, I think it is still not out of place, especially where you find um, some elements within PDP uh, not engaging in constructive uh, criticism of the government based on facts and issues, based on facts and figures and allegations that are verifiable, uh, then you will have no other option than to see uh, accusing fingers also coming from the ruling government. Uh, we are also dealing with the government uh, in terms of bringing forward issues that are more germane and playing opposition politics to the extent of that criticism that are based on constructive facts and not just their um, rhetorics and sentiments, then it becomes very easy uh, for other citizens to join them uh, in advocating for uh, uh, good government, representative government, transparency, uh, good governance. Uh, but um, unfortunately, the failure of the current government, it would seem there are some measures of difference, uh, which I would want to say that is also being included by some of the actions of the government. Uh, Whereas you, you can, you really can't have a record of the past government of under PDP uh, sanctioning some of those who are, who are accused or alleged of corruption, Telaudua and the rest of them. You would take um, a few efforts. Uh, in the case of uh, Ambassador OK, uh, in the case of um, Babashim, but the government already reversed that, you know, with the reinstatement of the two, the, the, the national health insurance. Oh, okay, uh, let me let me pause you for a moment. Um, Mr. Suraj, please stay with us. Uh, we will take a break, and when we come back, we get back into this matter. 
It's very important, isn't it? And you want to get some more perspectives and insights into the matter. Stay with us, everyone. We'll be right back.